Hello, what are milestones in Asana and how should they be used? That's a question I've had many times from different clients over the years. Um, and I just had that question come in from somebody today who asked me to put together a video for them. So this is that video. So milestones are kind of like tasks, but they're the key elements of delivering a project. So they're the things that kind of have to happen for that project to take place, key events that happen along the journey of a project. To create a milestone, um, we effectively uh, can create a task and then convert it, or we can create a milestone by clicking on the arrow and clicking add milestone. Um, the other way is to uh, create a normal task and then right click on it and click mark as milestone. Now, there's some things that you should know about milestones. Firstly, they all appear in a section on the front of the project, in the overview section, in a, in a section called milestones. So it's, it's a good way of seeing just those key events that need to take place along a project. They also appear in portfolios, which normal tasks don't. So if we go to a portfolio, all the milestones that are due on that project should appear here along the, um, the timeline. But as I say, normal tasks will not. So there's a couple of uh, uh, sort of differences in terms of milestones versus um, your, your normal task. And as I say, they can be used or should be used to denote important events along the uh, life cycle, life stage, life cycle of a project. Um, any questions, as always, please um, comment in the uh, section below. And I noticed Lots of you people watching these videos are not subscribed, so please do like, please do subscribe if you're not already subscribed, and I look forward to seeing you for another video soon.